Now, you may have heard talk of techies getting very excited over the new 5G network coming to Australia in early 2020. But the new wave of contact connectivity is more than just a step in the change in improved data rates or download speeds. 5G is being heralded as a game changer with the power to change the way we do business, contributing to billions of dollars to our economy. Julia Snook reports. From the way we get around to the way we manage our resources, the rollout of 5G is not going to just change the way we live our lives, it will even be used to save them. Autonomous drones designed to rescue people from the water are now operational at some of our best loved beaches. Right now, 4G doesn't have the capacity to support a fleet of drones. 5G will change that. The thing with 5G is that it will make it practical because you will have even more capacity to feedback video links. Say that you had a, a more difficult search event where you sent out a swarm of drones, maybe 10, 15 drones, all feeding back videos. Because of course, the more you have drones you have out there, the faster you find the person. That could mean the difference between life and death. So you want to be quick to find them. You need a lot of capacity going back. And with 5G, you get basically five things. You get more capacity, better speed, so you can get more high quality shorter latency if you want to control the drones using the 5G network and you also get the possibility of many different devices connected to the network and you can also give a dedicated uh, sort of part of the network to a special mission like drone and rescue so few things you get. 5G pushes some very high frequency components making it far more powerful than when we went from 3G to 4G. It's 10 times faster and 1 30th of the latency we have on 4G. That means processing times will be significantly better and faster and make devices far more responsive and reliable. Speaking to Business Weekend last month, Telstra CEO Andy Penn highlighted how 5G has the power to unlock all sorts of possibilities. 5G is the first telecommunication network that is specifically designed for the world of the Internet of Things, so connecting things that are not telephones. And that's where we see incredible opportunities within the enterprise segment, because as big industry uh, companies, you know, such as in mining and resources and manufacturing, as they look to automate their businesses, we're looking at a world where we're going to see sensors uh, in everything and everything being connected, and that creates incredible opportunity for growth for the New South Wales Chief Data Scientist, Dr Ian Opperman, the rollout of 5G next year offers enormous possibilities for businesses. What's being discussed is the factory of the future, the shipping terminal of the future, the, the mine of the future. So there's been a lot of emphasis on the productivity uplift associated with autonomous devices reliably being controlled in a much more complex communications environments. But there are still challenges to overcome. So one, one of the, the concerns is how much battery life your 5G device will have and that really is just a matter of, of working it through over time. We, we get really good at driving efficiencies into devices but only really after you've had a chance to deploy them. Despite the fact that the tech is in my opinion exciting and really amazing it really always comes back to what's the value proposition, what do you do as a business, how will you create value. Realising the potential of 5G, the Internet of Things and data collaboration is the purpose of the Telstra Vantage Conference in Melbourne this week. We're connecting around 2,000 devices a day on the Telstra IoT network. And so fast forward a couple of years, we're going to have millions and millions of devices all connected and being able to transmit data about different things, whether it be in agriculture or logistics or water, for example, and then being able to get that data and make sense of it and get some good insights, data insights, into how we can improve different industry sectors or use cases from that. McKinsey recently issued a report looking at the economic benefits of 5G, and what they said in their report was that by 2035, because of all the power that 5G will unlock in right across various uh, industries in, in our economy around the world, they're predicting that it will add $12 trillion to global economies with new jobs, new applications uh, and productivity improvements uh, to, to uh, various economies. So um, I think it's going to be very powerful indeed. The thing with Telstra right now and the 5G network is we are leading the world. 
in our developments in use cases for our enterprise customers, which is really exciting. And so we're, we're at the bleeding edge of this stuff in Australia and we're really proud of that.